the TMC and the Congress, right? Uh, Mamata Banerjee said, you leave Bengal to us, we will support you otherwise after the Karnataka victory. It doesn't look like the Congress has any, uh, you know, any intention of leaving Bengal to you. So my fundamental question is, no matter how many times you meet, how will you actually divide seats when you've got states in where many regional parties and the Congress have a stake? See, uh, you know, in Hindi, there is a saying, कि दे दुनिया भर में देश के लोग प्रधानमंत्री चुनते हैं समस्या का समाधान निकालने के लिए यहां हमने समस्या को ही प्रधानमंत्री बना कर रखा हुआ है सो दे वी नीड टू फाइंड अ सोल्यूशन टू द रेकरिंग प्रॉब्लम इन द कंट्री विच आर लार्जर देन एनी पॉलिटिकल पार्टी अनएम्प्लॉयमेंट इंफ्लेशन सेफ गार्डिंग द कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन एंड इट्स पीपल so it is the need of the hour that all the opposition parties come together i get that the but how congress, i'm telling you i'm telling you bear with me the congress the uh, you know the 17 opposition parties including the congress which is the single largest opposition party we have collectively formed a road map and we are in the process of doing that the next meeting is in shimla where our categorical I get that. No, but Riju, you are escaping the question I'm asking you. All of that is a given and understood. We're not questioning the intention or the requirement. I'm just asking you, how are you going to divide seeds? I'm sure you've heard what the Congress chief in the state has said just today. No, no, that, this is what I was coming to you before you interrupted me. And please give me a little courtesy of time. The Congress chief, Adil Chaudhary in Bengal, he is such a tall leader that after the independence of India, for the first time in Bengal, under his leadership, Congress is a big fat zero. He was not, he was the leader of the opposition at one point of time, who was not even invited as the star campaigner in Karnataka elections. The National Congress leadership who actually matters in decisions like this does not even entertain Adi Chaudhary in that meeting. So you're so saying that, that at the national way. level, the Congress thinks differently than their state leadership? That's what you're saying? Yes, the state leadership has no relevance. The Bengal Congress has no relevance when it comes to the National Congress, Rahul Gandhi and Mallik Arjun Kharge. It's very clear. But they have also not indicated that they are going to leave all of Bengal to you. But in any case, let me take that to Sujata Paul of the Congress Party. You know, this is this attack that your state leadership is not the one that will do the decision making and is actually good for nothing. It's not only coming from TMC. You look at the Aam Admi Party. They are also heading out at your Delhi and Punjab leadership the state leadership for opposing the ordinance, the Delhi ordinance by the central government. It looks like uh, these regional alliance partners of yours, they want you to give them the space that they feel they have earned, but is the Congress willing to do so? And they're attacking your state units day after day. Well, <clears throat> as far as attacking uh, somebody is concerned, this is a democracy and everybody has a right to voice their opinion. So, so do we. And uh, if there are concerns, we must also remember that right now when we are talking about the Lok Sabha elections, the focus is entirely different. It is on the issues of this country, the democracy and the constitution. Mm. So what, and we are a federal structure, no matter how much uh, the federal structure has been disrespected in the last nine months, because uh, there, there is a party in power which uh, worships one man. We worship the people of India, and I'm sure that every other party also does it. And if they do, then, of course, it will be a fight between both Sevadis and Gandhi Vadi. No, and no, all the Gandhi I'm discussing the nitty-gritty. Sujata Ji, again, you're getting into the larger reason why you have come together. We've discussed that, and you have all the right. Even if there wasn't a reason, you could come together. You don't have to justify the reason. I'm just asking you, how are you going to divide the seeds? Is Congress willing to I give did. up Bengal? Of course, uh, we are going to look right now. The issue is saving the country. And when we are talking about saving the country, we have to save the country from the hate politics, the communalism, the issues. And we have to stand for the people of this country. And that is why, as far as... But Ajay Markan doesn't think so on the issue of our Aadmi Party. Adhi Ranjan Chaudhary doesn't think so on the issue of the TMC. How will your cadre on ground and your leaders on ground see eye to eye? When you talk about India, it's a federal country. And in, in, the, in a federal structure, issues in a state are very different when we compare it to... <laughs> yes, the but we're talking about Lok Sabha elections. We're not talking about state elections. So that's what we are talking about. So when you are talking about states. Within the states, if there is a problem and uh, we, if there are issues, well, 
we are with the left in uh, various places, but we are fighting the left in Kerala. How do you explain that? Precisely and my so question. As far as, yeah, that's fine. There's no problem with that. And uh, so when we talk about uh, the state, huh. there are certain issues which we will fight at that level and every party will. Okay, be can, I ask you, can I ask you one more part. question uh, before I go to our other guests? You're talking about coming together for Lok Sabha elections under a larger umbrella for a larger cause. But you can't even come together and see eye to eye for panchayat elections. How are you going we, to make, we, cut out, you know, carve out your kitties for Lok Sabha? Huh. I'll give you an example. In Meghalaya, the Prime Minister had gone and uh, attacked Conrad Sangma and his party, called them, uh, you know, accused them of nepotism and corruption. Hmm. But when they won two seats and they saw that Conrad Sangma was going to come into power, he gave them a call and they are in power with uh, Conrad Sangma's government. So but it's going to be post-elections. So in, 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 in uh, politics, nobody is a permanent friend. And nobody's a no, no, I'm not questioning that at all. But interesting what you say. You're basically saying there's not going to be seat sharing before elections, but we'll come together if need be and if the verdict is such, post-elections. Not at all. I never said that. See, but you've given an example of two people concerned. fighting and then coming together. I am said, so when they are doing uh, what they did is an example for everybody to see. But Himachal Pradesh meeting is going to tell us okay. what the strategy is for that. And the deeper strategy is not going to be discussed on television. Fair enough. Let